Bangkok is an amazing city packed with delicious Thai dishes and street foods. In this video, get ready to come with us to explore some of the most amazing traditional and authentic Thai dishes and street foods inside of some of the best food courts in Bangkok. Since its opening, Pier 21 has been regarded as one of the best food courts in Bangkok. Not only does the variety stands this food court out, but the amazing cheap prices for the food here attracts eaters from all over the world, offering good Thai cuisines and Thai street foods, with Chinese, Indian and Vietnamese options as well. For something sweet, head for a kiosk selling traditional Thai desserts and fruit smoothies. Mango sticky rice is also a very popular choice here. The first stall, called papaya salad, serves delicious different variations of delicious salads and fried chickens. Priced between 30 to 35 baht, which converts to around 1 USD. Another store I highly recommend is the number 10 a la carte menus. They serve some of the most tasty and aromatic rice dishes in the food court. And of course, the smoothie store that everyone loves, selling smoothies for as cheap as 20 baht. They are one of the tastiest cool beverage to have in a hot day in Bangkok. I have ordered the papaya salad, pork boat noodles, and a mixed fruit smoothie. For all of the food here, I paid around 118 baht, which converts to only around 3 US dollars. Although there are hundreds of tables and seats available, the food court is so popular, it could be difficult to find a table during busy hours. The tables next to the windows is the best place to enjoy a cheap and delicious meal with a great view of central Bangkok. Next, the MBK Legend Food Court. The MBK Shopping Mall is a very popular destination among visitors. On the sixth floor, is the MBK Food Legend Food Court with more than 20 stalls offering affordable prices for better than average traditional Thai and street foods. There are also a good selection of Indian and Arabian foods available in this food court. Serving delicious local Thai dishes such as Kaman Gai which is chicken with rice cooked in chicken fat, flavorful stir fries, Hong Kong style crispy duck and pork, and so much more. Many dishes prices ranges from 50 to 100 baht, which is a very good price considering the shopping mall is in Siam, which is a very luxurious an expensive area. You will find many stalls selling dishes with great portions. The stew pork knuckle rice costed 75 baht and was absolutely delicious. The meat that has been stewed for hours is still juicy and succulent. And of course, my favorite Thai street food dish, chicken rice, locally known as Kamangai, is only 60 baht in the Food Legends food court. There are well over a hundred tables in the MBK food court, just about enough seating to host hundreds of local Thais and tourists enjoying their delicious meal here. Most food courts in Bangkok will not accept cash. To pay and purchase for foods, usually you will have to get a food court card and deposit money into it. There is also a self service machine where you can enter the exact amount of cash you want to pay and receive a paper coupon with a QR code. Mm. 
Not many tourists know of this market with an amazing food court inside. Most travelers exploring Ceylon would not even notice there was a huge market tucked behind what looks like to be a very ordinary street. The market is absolutely buzzing during lunch times. Ceylon is filled with large office buildings and workers from the area loves enjoying their lunch here. The food court is large enough to have enough seating for around 400 people. Despite its size, it could get difficult to get a seat during the main lunchtime rush. Food stalls are located on both sides as well as down the centre. You will find all types of delicious and authentic Thai foods and street foods here. And you will not go wrong with choosing any of the dishes here. The price is great and the food would send your taste buds to heaven. With stalls on the side focusing on selling Thai dishes, whereas the center part sells many local delicious Thai snacks. The market is open from 8 am to 3 pm, but the best time to come is around 11 in the morning to 1 in the afternoon, when all of the food stalls are open and have their full menu available. Siam Paragon, one of the most famous shopping malls in Bangkok, houses one of the best food scene in the city. The restaurants here are well worth visiting, but the food hall is where many food lovers enjoy a huge variety of foods. The food hall is divided into three different zones. The food hall food court, street food section, and the food hall take home. The foods here from the three zones combined will blow you away with traditional Thai dishes, street foods such as skewers, grilled chicken, deep fried pork bites, and crispy porks. Alongside a very good selection of Thai desserts and snacks, the food court offers a very good alternative food scene in the luxurious Siam Paragon shopping mall. And for anyone that remembers and loves the toasted bun store in Chinatown, they have a branch here. For the toasted bun fans, you can enjoy it here without having to head off to Chinatown. Pier 21 Food Court is not the only great food court in Asok for delicious street foods and Thai dishes. Situated on Montreal Road in Midtown Asok is the Rumsat Market. As a local market that aims to feed hungry office workers in the nearby area, you can expect to find some very local Thai dishes for a very good price. Most of the dishes here would be around 50 baht which is around one and a half USD. There is also a street food section that sells many delicious looking takeaway foods, snacks and desserts. You will also find a handful of cafes selling coffees and smoothies.
On Google Map, it says the market opens till 7 p.m. at night, but from my experience, many of the food stores here will close at around 2 to 3 p.m. in the afternoon. If there is a food court that you'd love to visit every time you travel to Bangkok, share it with us in the comment section below. For even more amazing street food areas in Bangkok, check out the videos here.